Hi, I'm Sasha Segan, lead analyst at PCMag.com, and this crazy thing came in the mail today. This is the box for the OnePlus 7T. Now, I love OnePlus, they're a really fun company to deal with, uh, but normally this is the size of a phone box. Uh, this is the box for the OnePlus 7 Pro and 5G even, like 5G, you would think it would be bigger, but no, it is a normal size phone box. But for the OnePlus 7T, this thing arrived. So I don't even know what's in it. This isn't going to be one of those unboxings where like the guy has figured out everything in there beforehand and is reading from a script and all of that. No, I have not opened this box yet. So you are going to feel this discovery along with me. So come along, let's feel the discovery. What what the heck is in this box that presumably contains one of these boxes? Let's see. So sliding off the big outer wrapper, and I see here that we have the OnePlus Never Settle logo on it. Okay, definitely from OnePlus. And then how does this open? Okay, so it splits, whoa. It's like a, it's like a DeLorean or something. It's got like suicide doors. Is that what suicide doors are? I don't know. Okay, so yeah, ooh. And then inside, so we've got, this thing here that says OnePlus on it, and it opens up, and I suspect I know what it is, because OnePlus always has a reviewer's guide. The reviewer's guide this year is printed on some nice matte paper um, with very few words per page, but going down all of the basic features, and then of course we have the spec sheets here. Now you are probably watching this shortly after the device announcement, so there's going to be spec sheets online and all that stuff is going to be on the OnePlus website and you almost certainly have access to it where I don't right here right now, so I'm not gonna read out the specs to you. You can find the specs online. I'm gonna look at what's in this box. Okay, so a uh, little wipe, always nice. Next level, we have a door. What is behind door number one? Let's see, a notebook. Can I get the notebook out? Hmm. Let's see. Come on. The notebook is stuck. Okay. Oh. Let's get that there. See, I told you this was going to be uh, a little messy. Pry the notebook out with my knife. Come on. There we go. Okay, so we have a notebook. It is a OnePlus Moleskin. Is it lined? Important reviewer question. It is lined for taking your OnePlus notes in. OnePlus always has nice little touches like this. Under that, we have a sandstone case, a carbon fiber case, a red case, silicone. And of course, you notice on all of these cases, what is special about these cases? The big disc. And of course, we'll see when we open up the phone what the big disc means. Next part of the box we have, now this is obviously the phone. This is the OnePlus 7T, which is one and a half times as long as the OnePlus 7, maybe. Under it, spacer. Some new bullets wireless. These are OnePlus's really nice Bluetooth headphones. Uh, they are now coming in an olive green color. I'll set these aside. Everything else seems to be filler. So let's uh, close up the main box and look in the phone box itself. So here we have the phone box. Now this is a more reasonable size for a phone box, but of course still, why is it one and a half times as long as the previous phone box? This is all very funny, especially because the OnePlus 7T is more affordable than the OnePlus 7 Pro. This is supposed to be, I, I'm not even sure I can call it a lower end phone because it uses a faster processor. It's got the uh, Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 Plus instead of the 855, but there's a lot of one step forward, one and a half steps back things about this phone. Uh, for instance, it's got a 2X instead of a 3X zoom. It doesn't have the mechanical pop-up uh, selfie camera. Uh, the screen is 1080p-ish instead of 2K-ish. All to make it slightly less expensive. So now I think, is this going to be the retail box? I don't know, let's see. Okay, so we have your invitation letter. 
welcome to OnePlus. I feel like I was invited to OnePlus a long time ago. Remember when you could only get OnePlus phones by invitation? That wasn't too long ago. Yeah, the invitation letter is a lovely letter from Pete Lau, obviously written directly to me because Pete Lau sees into my soul. Um, let's see what else we have in here. Yep, uh, stickers to show your loyalty to OnePlus. And then, of course, the phone itself. Under the phone, we will get back to the phone itself. I know it's the most important thing. Uh, under the phone, there is, now the phone will come with a clear case. All of these other cases are, of course, optional. And this is the reviewer kit, so we get all of these accessories as part of the review. But when you buy the phone, you will get this clear case. You will get this SIM tool. You will get this USB cable. You will get this Warp Charge 30T adapter, which charges the whole phone in an hour. It is a chunky boy, but it is, uh, it is, it is a super fast adapter. You will not get any headphones. Notice there are no headphones in this box. You will have to buy these separately or buy uh, OnePlus's USB-C bullets, which are still out there. I believe they are only 20 bucks and they are really good. I actually use them. They are my wired headphones. Um, so then we have the phone itself. And this is not a video review of the OnePlus 7T. This is just me taking stuff out of the box. But you see that it has the big camera disc on the back with the three cameras, as opposed to the OnePlus 7 Pro, which I'll pop out here, where it's a more linear camera arrangement. The 7T comes in blue and silver. Uh, this is the blue one. And instead of the pop-up, uh, instead of the pop-up selfie camera, we have a notch at the top, tiny little notch. And that is, of course, one of the things that makes this a little less expensive than the OnePlus 7 Pro. Now, this phone is not even set up. I can't review it right now. I haven't reviewed it. It's gonna be a while until I review it, but that is what is in the giant OnePlus box. We have a hands-on of this on PCMag.com. Of course, I will be reviewing this phone. Uh, this phone is coming out direct from OnePlus and on T-Mobile, and of course, on a range of carriers and through other channels around the world. Uh, this has been Sasha Segan from PCMag.com unboxing the giant media kit for the OnePlus 7T.